basically my motivation comes from the fact that I really the satisfaction I get from doing well is immense. It like beats anything. The, the fact that I've done well in something and given it my all makes me happy. So I, that's my source of motivation. I think my source of motivation is to get into a good college, get marks. That's it. When you get you know pat on the back, yes, you've done well and everything. But that's only secondary to the satisfaction you get for yourself. First one uh, who's just studying for the marks obviously is showing a high need for achievement and probably a high need for power. My motivation to study, while I do want to do well for myself because I know it's going to help me eventually, comes more from the fact that I want to do well because I like the teacher that's teaching a particular subject or because I'm in a class with really interesting people that makes me enjoy that class and therefore that subject. In such classes, I'm, I study hard even if sometimes the subject matter is boring, more because I want the teacher in, in that particular case to be proud of me rather than because I personally want to do well. In the second case, uh, where the child is studying for the love for the subject, obviously is showing also a, a love for learning, a love for, the, you know, quest for knowledge, etc. Expanding one's mind and includes, apart from a sense of achievement, sense of power, also includes a high need for affiliation.